Hey guys, welcome to my channel. And today we are going to be doing a little art tutorial. And I hope this is okay, but um I am just very excited to be doing this, so let's get to it. Today we are going to be drawing a flower vase full of some fun flowers basically so yeah let's get started so what you're going to need a pencil a blank sheet of paper and well your hand so all all of your supplies are right here one pencil with an with a good eraser so let's get started you're going to want to start with your vase so I always like, there's this one picture I always like to do. So I always start off with making the spot where my vase starts. And yeah, so it's starting right here. And then a few inches away, you're going to want to make another one. And then you're going to want to draw a line right there, and then so that it makes a triangle like this, but don't actually make that point. Then you're going to want to kind of color a bit of a rectangle down like that, and make a nice swirl like that. So we are working on our ba our vase right now. You're going to need to make three of these. So just kind of hang in there for a minute while I do this. And you're going to make sure you fill in all of the empty spaces where you haven't drawn anything. Like, see here, this swirl continues right through this one right behind it and then you're going to want to do the same thing on this now remember this doesn't have to be perfect okay so next we're going to want to start with kind of drawing some lines right there to make it look formal and then if you have any excess like that one there you're going to want to erase it Okay. Now you're gonna now let's draw our hardest flower. You're gonna want to make the stem, and then this only has two branches, but tiny branches with it. Okay. Okay, so now let's just kind of draw a branch like that. We're drawing flowers kind of like this. Those are the kind of flower you're drawing multiples of these flowers. Make sure you always have that dot in the center. Okay. So now you have one branch done. We're going to need to make another. So this one is going to dip underneath. That one was kind of sloppy, but... This drawing is, at the moment, if you just draw a bunch of these, it's this kind of flower. It's not really that difficult. So, so this is what it looks like on the top so far. I made a mistake right here. So, I'm just going to leave that. 
you you guys can erase it, but I'm not going to take the time at the moment to erase it. I'll erase it before I complete the, I've completely finish this drawing. But yeah, you're just going to kind of want to make a bunch of these flowers. And this should be my last one. So yeah, we have this. And now, from... For the single but stem with multiple branches going out again. But this time we're making a rose shape. And now for this, you're going to want to take, to take a line. And I'm going to make that shape. I'll show you with another one. Um, let's do over here. You're going to just kind of want to follow it in this order. You're gonna want to make them different sizes, so, and after that, we're going to make some leaves. Okay, you should have a total of four leaves that look kind of like that. Then you're gonna want to take and draw a nice line and just make it like that. Yeah, so we have that. We need to just quickly add it to this flower. Personally, this is my favorite piece of artwork to draw. I do actually have an art book which is just to which is just over to my left. But I'm not gonna worry about that right now. I'll go through it sometime. But I only have about mm, four drawings in there, probably. I just got it a few days ago. But yeah, this is just my favorite one to draw. So, yeah, this is your drawing right now. You can also add a flower just here if you wanted, but I don't normally do that. You can if you want, because, you know, it's your drawing. But, yeah, I just really like this one, so I decided to share it with you. This is actually a piece of artwork that I designed myself. It's no other artist has ever done it before, except for me. So, yeah. There it is. Hope you enjoyed it. But now if you want to add some detail, this is kind of what I do. I like to etch kind of a table behind it. And if you're etching a table, kind of make some weird, just kind of make some off centered lines. Kind of make it on a table. Make sure you add your legs. So yeah, I kind of like to add maybe a teacup.
So that's all I got for the moment. But sometimes I like to make it into a good drawing inside of your drawing. I just always thought that was kind of fun. But again, it's your drawing, not mine. That's all I got for today, though. So you kind of want to, I kind of have my teacup over here. A large teacup over here. That looks kind of like this one right there. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. But anyway, I kind of do a bit of a picture. Again, you guys can do this if you want to. Yeah, so that's all I got right now. I hope you enjoyed. See you all next time. Goodbye!